can certainly sense the tension during Christopher Bouchard's arraignment. More than a dozen friends and family of the victims packed into the courtroom this morning, and the mother of one of the victims yelling out when bail was set. Emotions of outrage and frustration erupting as the families of the two dead men left the central Islip courtroom Friday. Let me tell you something. I got to go do an autopsy on my son today. The mother of Anthony Garriquez, the most vocal. It's murder. 27 year old Christopher Bouchard facing a charge of reckless endangerment in connection with the deaths of 20 year olds Garriquez and 19 year old Keenan King. Investigators say both men were killed thrown off this dirt bike when Bouchard, with his brother in the passenger seat, allegedly used his minivan to chase the pair Thursday morning as they were riding on Montauk Highway. Bouchard was tailing them because he thought the bike was stolen and belonged to his brother. Prosecutors describe it as a high speed chase with Bouchard crossing into oncoming traffic before hitting the bike, sending Garikas and King flying. Neither men had on helmets. Anything you have to say to those families? There was no intent. My client never intended to hurt anybody. His heart goes out to the family and the, and the victims. It's a tragedy, and there's certainly no intent to hurt anyone. An explanation these families aren't buying, the words doing nothing to stop their anger. I want him to rot in jail. And Bouchard is being held on $500,000 cash bail. Prosecutors say that there is video footage of the chase and that charge of reckless endangerment, they say, will likely be upgraded. Reporting live this afternoon from Central Islip, Long Island, Janelle Burrell, CBS2 News.